Hi guys, welcome back to Prospector's Cash. Today I'm gonna uh, revisit a subject I talked to you guys about in the past, and that's about the remote control box mounting for the XP Deus II metal detectors. Uh, as many of you guys know, I bought this control box mounting to use on many of my detectors. And um, it's really good, but there are, it could stand a few improvements. And uh, so I've started improving my XP Deus II. And one of the ways I did that is I come up with a little bit better control box mounting. This one here, if you notice, is fixed to the shaft and it's at a right angle. You have to either order a right angle or left angle one. On my new system, you can choose straight, right, or left and uh, mount it any of those three ways. So you can tilt it to the right, tilt it to the left, or you can look at it straight on when you're looking at the RC box. Uh, I normally mount mine tilted to the right. Uh, that's the way this one's mounted on here. Um, another thing about this is the, the one that I had here does not have a hole to allow the antenna wire to go all the way from the coil through the rod, up through the hole, and into this box. So you had to run the antenna wire on the outside, which I didn't like. It got caught on things when I was trying to metal detect, especially underwater. Uh, so I made an improvement that allows you to mount the antenna, uh, antenna wire all the way up the inside of this rod, all the way up through and mount it into the control box up here. Um, so that's another advantage of the one I'm doing. Uh, it also has a removable plate on the bottom on the new one, and I'll show you that in a minute, that allows you to run it externally if you want to. So you can, you can still do it externally if you want to, or you can run it inside the box. And let me get out what I'm, what I'm showing here. We'll get rid of this one here. I'll take it off. I'll take my little set screw out here. And these little screws are hard to get in and out because they're so small. Pull that guy out. I'll take my control box out of this unit. Notice there's two thumb screws on this one. Uh, I got tired of doing two, so I designed mine with one set screw to hold that to it. So we'll get rid of this one. And I'll show you what you get. This is how it will be shipped to you. This will be at XP Deus II uh, RC mount. And you'll notice that in the bag, there's some parts. And this is the actual box that it's mounted in. It's similar to the other one, but it's not the same. Uh, not anything like the other one other than kind of kind of resembles it. It has one screw hole on the top up here. You have a, this is a left mount. And this is a straight mount, and it comes pre-assembled with the right-hand mount on it with the thumb screw completely in this unit. But the other thing is, you'll notice the bottom housing here. This has a hole in it to allow water to drain, which that one did not have a hole in it. Also, this one lets the antenna wire run internally, so you can't even see the antenna wire. But if you want to run the antenna wire externally, you'll change out this plate here and then the antenna wire can go right up this little hole right here. So you'll see that plate there doesn't cover that hole, so it allows it to run up to the top. So let's get done with mounting this. Mounting this after you remove your uh, standard XP Deus II mount up there, you just slip this guy in like so. The way you get it from, from me, it just slips right into the shaft. And then it has a screw that goes right in here. Screw it down good and tight. You only need one screw and then the screw is provided. All the screws and stuff are provided on this. So one screw, take off the top here. I'm gonna tighten that down a little bit more. Take off the top. Slide the box in there. You can, antenna wire will run right across the top there. If you're using an antenna wire, if you're using it just as a 
a land machine, you wouldn't worry about it. Top goes on there like so. And the unit is now mounted on there. So it's uh, mounted solidly on there. It, you can tighten this screw up a little tighter and get it to where it doesn't wobble as bad. But there you go. That's what it looks like. Also, I've got uh, other new things I want to introduce. I got a magnetic pinpointer holder I really like. And then I uh, also have some feet for the XP Deus too. And you can find those all on TomAshworth.com. But uh, I'll talk more about them later. This is just talking about the remote control housing cover.